that they're taking all the main of the family. They're killing them right away. Mohammed Amin kid. Sahel worked alongside U.S. Marines for five years as an interpreter in Afghanistan. When he had the opportunity to escape this, he did. The only thing that I could take was my family. It's the kindness of strangers who are helping them now. Thank you very much. So much. The family walked into Oasis International in the morning. By the afternoon, a truck full of furniture arrived. Joni and Mark Akers started their refugee ministry 15 years ago. After traveling abroad as missionaries, I was visiting an Ethiopian family here in St. Louis. I walked in the door and it was just bare hardwood floor. Our eyes were just open to what was happening in our own city. I told all my friends, you need to give me your stuff. Today, thousands of refugees from 50 nations have come through the Oasis doors. Everything is, 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 is different than our countries. They are like my family. Our goal was to help every refugee that came to St. Louis with a whole house full of furniture, their clothes, English classes, citizenship classes, baby showers. Well, we just wanted to help. Joni and Mark's mission now to help these refugees rebuild their lives. I remember one mom saying, you know, I just, I don't want my children to grow up with a war going on all the time. I can see a bright future for them, and I'm so happy for that. I'm Nancy Alvarez reporting.